cold outside, but the fire keeps us warm. We can't Good spend Good morning, guys. It is Monday. It's Monday. Yes, darling. It's Monday morning. I'm just about to get in the shower. We need to get ready because we're going to Birmingham today for the girl knows all pop up shop tomorrow. Um, I'm just about to get in the shower. I need to rinse off this pan. Sorry, it's noisy. I'll catch up with you guys in a bit. So I'm really needing to sort my, well, this part of my hair is a little bit grey, isn't it? Grey? Yeah. Yeah. A little bit. I think it's because that bit was so blonde and where the tone is now washing out. I think that's why. A monkey hanging your boot. Monkey? A monkey hanging your boot. Monkey behind the boot? Yeah, where? Oh yeah, it's not a monkey, it's a lion on the yeah. Peugeot logo. So we're just waiting for the boat, the kids are in the back. The kids are very tired, especially Sophia. Um, but we kept her awake. Oh, we're loading, hold on. We kept her awake purposely so she was sleeping in the car. Um, we sorted out the iPad, downloaded loads of stuff. Um, Baba? I'm gonna get a coffee on here if they do do oat milk. They never normally, I don't understand, they never normally do. Mm -hmm. They hit a mix, aren't they? We will leave this we'll muse the car. Muse. Yeah, we're always in. Gemma and Jamie's brand. This fits like an XL. Yeah, and that's a medium. And this is a medium too. Oh no, I got that in a large. Oh really? Yeah, that's a large. This so is even an XL though. would fit me? Some work on the way up. Kill two birds with one stone. Till we perfect for this week. Tomorrow it is Christmas. The first for you and me. Cause all I wanna do is spend this holiday. Tomorrow it is Christmas, the first for me and you. I longed for this moment to have you for myself in a cabin out of nowhere, just us and no one else. I've decorated everything till we perfect for this week. Tomorrow. Caramel syrup, please. Caramel. Yeah, that's fine. Is that everything? Uh, yes, thank you. Okay, come on down. Cheers, thank you. Thank you. Let's smell that. Smell okay, we've found a service station. So, Con's just run in to get some McDonald's. Both the kids have actually woken up now, so I'm gonna get them a happy meal, just put on the film, let them enjoy that. And yeah, I'm gonna get on and edit. I'm really excited to go shopping, guys. Like, I'm gonna bring you with me, but I'm really excited about it. <laughs> I think it's a big shopping center, so I'm very excited. I wanna go to Zara. They even have a Selfridges. I need to go to Selfridges. I need to get a new filter by Molly May. I don't need to tan anymore today, but my one is running out at home. I'd like to look in the Adenola section. I wanna get some cute bits from Zara for the kids, and I wanna look in there for myself. So yeah, I'm very excited. These kind of trips really, really excite me. And it's so last minute and I usually say no to these kind of things just because I get so anxious about them. But I actually don't feel anxious about this at all. I feel like it's because I, I feel like I know the Girl Knows All team. And I'm excited just to pop in and go through the pop-up shop. I want to have a look around myself. Um, and it'd just be really cool like just to see my own collection in a store. Like, wow. That's crazy and obviously it's great footage for vlogmas for you guys to see as well and I'm just really 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 loving filming at the moment. I'm, I'm really loving YouTube, keeping you guys updated, being motivated to be on it and just keeping busy is my favourite thing in the whole world. And I feel like when I fall down that rabbit hole it's so hard to get back out so when I'm on it I never want to like stop being on it. So yeah I feel like I am just... 
I'm finally feeling back myself. Like, it's weird because the amount of times I've said that, but as I've said, I've had this horrible sinking feeling in my stomach because I'm like, I don't think that's actually true. I feel like you're trying to convince yourself you're feeling back to yourself, but you are not yourself. But now, but now I feel like I'm myself, but a completely different version of myself. Like, my priorities have changed so much. As I said, I'll talk about, like, all these kind of things in a separate catch up year review kind of video. Um, like it's really good to chat through a lot of things, but I'm also learning that I'm wanting to be a little bit more, not private, but like I don't need to share everything with you guys as much as I love to be so honest. It also makes me feel really vulnerable. You know, when there's just certain people that you don't want knowing your information, <laughs> your personal information, but like I forget that even people I know will be watching my videos. Um, people I know that I don't want to know my information. Um, so yeah, I'm just I'm just learning. I've learned so much about myself this year, and I honestly feel like I am a whole new person. And I am I'm loving. I'm excited for this next chapter. This last chapter has been hideous. Okay, this little chapter in my life has been hideous. You don't need me to tell you that again. You guys know I've struggled. But I finally, I don't even feel like I'm back to myself. I just finally feel like a whole new person. I'm so much happier. I'm feeling so much more like just enjoying every day. And as I said, like my priorities and everything have changed a lot, which I can talk about in a whole nother video because that was not meant to be the ramble, it was. So I'm gonna get on and edit. I'm gonna eat my nuggets. That's what I've ordered. Here he is. It's white outside And the night is cold Everyone's lighting candles in their home so good, haven't you? So yeah, the hotel is literally just here. I don't know if there's actually parking in the hotel. When I read online, um, it did say parking. Someone said it wasn't actually in the hotel, but this is literally right next to it. So, so we're in the hotel room. Literally, no, we came in the room. We went straight to the toilet. This is what our room looks like. She is caught. This is absolutely perfect. <laughs> Do you see like the hotel? Oh, no, I'm not sure. Yes. Right, put your hat. And me, what's my hand? Do your hat first. I'll move my hat. Who wants toys? Guys, we made it to the hotel. We're just about to go out. Fia, come stand up here. Hello. Hello, stand up here. But I want to get a picture of all of us. Mm -hmm. Is a time to cheer. Let our love minds, our family and friends have a Christmas with so much love and with joy and laughter. Let us make memories that stay. Snow is falling down, all the colored lights lighting up this town. And as I walk outside, hear the Christmas choir sing, Merry Christmas to you. John's and it looks unreal. Look at Liv's kebab. So we're back. I'm gonna be a little bit more quiet because actually, oh. um, I'm gonna be a little bit more quiet. Mm. Lead away. Okay, as I was saying, I'm gonna show you guys the few bits that I picked up today. Um, we weren't there for very long just because the kids were overtired, but 
We went to Selfridges, picked up two things in Selfridges from Adenola. And then I just picked up kids' bits in Zara. Um, so I'll show you the Adenola stuff first. So I picked up this sweatshirt. They didn't have a lot of options in there. This is the size medium. I think I would have preferred a large, but this is all they had. Um, but I will try that on in a second because I also picked up this, which I thought was really cute. What size did I get this in? I feel like it's probably like a medium. Yeah, a medium. And this is just a little unitard, which I thought was really, really cute. So I'm gonna try this on, try that sweatshirt on. This is actually quite cute. Um, a little bit see-through. It is just quite revealing, but I think you wouldn't wear it alone. Also, I've got black pants on. I think I'd probably style it with like the jumper that I had on earlier on top. Did anyone else do this? Like stick out your belly and think, oh, this would look really cute pregnant. <laughs> I would have preferred a large. I don't think that's too bad actually. It's just got this print on the back, which is a little bit summery, but I think it's cute, right? And then in terms of the kids' stuff, to be honest, the kids' section was a bit of a blur to me. I would have preferred to look a little bit longer, but no, I was just being a little shit. Um, which is okay. He's three, it happens. Anyways, I picked this up for Fia. I got this actually in age two to three, just because A, it lasts longer. I'm that parent that buys things. No, I'm not. I just buy, I just buy things oversized because I like them oversized. That's the style I like. But also, because obviously it has the detail of the shirt underneath, it makes the jumper shorter. So I thought if I got it bigger, it wouldn't look abnormally short on her. And yeah, it will last longer. No, it was really who was mainly looking for anyway. So I picked him up these trousers, which I thought were really nice. I got him this little sweatshirt. I got this in four to five, just so it's oversized and baggy. He's in three to four. Um, so I picked this one up in four to five as well. Because as I said, I just love these sweatshirts to be like super baggy. And again, it's just a bonus because they last longer. I then got three of these trousers in her normal size. Well actually 18 to 24 is actually a little bit big for her. Um, but yeah, I got her these leggings because I thought they were really cute. And again, they just go with so much. And I've got her with this t-shirt in a three to four. So that's all I've picked up. There was definitely a lot more I could have spent. Maybe that will happen tomorrow because I think, I actually think the pop shop is in the ball ring. That place is bloody huge. Like I can't even stress how much we got lost. Also, even getting there took us ages. The roads here are so confusing. <laughs> There's people cutting you up left, right, and centre. The lanes like cross over. It was just a whole lot. But we're back now. literally look so tired this morning. We are at the Costa drive through right now and we're gonna have to Merry Christmas, baby. Is coming out to play. Santa Claus is back. Guys, it looks so cool in here. Also, this collection launches Thursday and it's so cool, but they have it in store tomorrow. I'm gonna pick up some pieces myself actually. I'm gonna pick up this. I got this for my sister for Christmas last year. Guys, sorry I didn't get loads and loads of footage, but 
I was just having the best time. It was so cute, it was so lovely. The girls I literally just love, they are so sweet and we're trying to find a KFC right now. We're going KFC? Yeah. Is it alright? Lovely, that's what we want. Oh. Um, we're just trying to get out of Birmingham, this place. Anyways, I had the best time, I love the girls there and they were saying that my collection is the best seller. How crazy is that? Like how actually good is that? Caught ya. This place is so confusing. Not only is it huge, the shopping centre is huge. Literally the biggest shopping centre I've ever been to in my life. Is it you? Yeah. But these roads are so in Birmingham are so confusing. Literally so confusing. Um, but anyways, we're heading home now. But yeah, I'm just so grateful for these opportunities. Honestly, it just mind blows me. Blows my mind. Um, and I did pick up a few bits, so when the kids are asleep, I'll show you what I picked up. I'm also going to get changed into my new pieces because I'm that excited. I also should hopefully... Oh, imagine if my order's at home when I get home. I did a huge Garno's order and it's been sent out, but Royal Mail, like, did delayed you order it. all the stuff you just bought? No, none of the stuff that I just bought, obviously. <laughs> so far I have not finished them because I've just continued vlogging but I thought I'd just come on here and end this vlog I literally I don't think I filmed hardly anything yesterday coming back because on the way home I just started feeling so unwell like I felt like I'd been hit by a bus this morning well in the night I woke up and when I got into bed last night I just felt so rough so I took some paracetamol and then I was up in the night quite a lot I feel like I've got some kind of flu like my whole body aches my throat is really sore I'm more like congested like back here I don't even know how to describe it like all around here um that's not the best start to the day today I'm talking to you guys I've got a bit of play-doh on my face but yeah thank you so much for watching this video I'm actually wearing one of the hoodies now um my parcel with all the other Garno's all stuff I had actually ordered um myself was at home when I got home yesterday so I'll, sh I'll show you guys that ne in the next vlog I honestly can't string a sentence together right now I'm so tired I feel so crap and everyone literally everyone I know has been falling and I was doing fine and then I didn't take my vitamins for like two three days and then this has happened um both the kids are poorly as well uh, it's just never ending these illnesses it honestly is never ending um like if you guys think that we're always ill imagine living it like honestly <laughs> it's it's so draining anyway if i'll catch you guys in my next vlog i don't know if that will be tomorrow or maybe in a couple of days because i'm not going to be filming a lot oh, i'm not going to be filming a lot sorry i'm not crying i just yawned i'm not going to be filming a lot in the next couple of days it's going to be working <sighs> we've just got so much to sort in the house as well like it's just always messy and i don't even know how don't know how it comes to this and it, it stresses me out i can't have the house messy don't have the energy to do anything so love that for me getting the car clean today though so actually i'm just gonna save this for the next one yeah i hope you guys know how grateful i truly truly am for these experiences in my life like honestly when i first started youtube i would have only have dreamed of doing things like this and i just love working with garnozel they are a dream team they're so lovely 
and stay tuned is all I'm gonna say. I'm just, yeah, beyond grateful.